what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? 57-year-old Elston Stevenson is serving 15 years in prison for shooting 39-year-old Murad Talib after he was already dead. Backstory. A family is gathered at the cemetery to say their last goodbyes, to send their loved one off, who was murdered two days prior, shot several times in Chicago. The family is gathered around and this guy, Elston, walks up and says, you ain't shit, you got what you deserve, as he fires one shot into the grave of Murad Talib. They gave him 15 years, family. That's more time than the cop got for walking inside of Botham John's house and murdering him. That's more time than Tamir Rice's killer got, Trayvon Martin's killer got, Michael Brown's killer got, and so on and so on and so on. This man shot a corpse. Now, I'm not making any excuses for him because this got to be one this got to be one bad man to shoot somebody's grave, to be that filled with hate. Or was it an after hit, an after death, an after life hit? There's rumors that he was paid to do that. So it may not have been personal. His lawyer argued that he was on heroin and that may have contributed to it or that he may have been paid. That's what the rumor is, that he was, in pay, he was paid to go out there and intimidate the survivors. Anything's possible. But damn, if either way, that's cold-blooded, man. Shooting a man while he's in his grave? That's cold-blooded, right through the coffin. This dude, they say, has a criminal record dating back to the 70s that include theft, robbery, aggravated assault, and da, 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 attempted murder. I'm surprised it's just attempted murder. I would have thought he had at least, I don't know, 17 murders on his belt. I would think he had at least 17 bodies, 17, 18, 19 bodies. This dude got some nerve. Talk about, now if it was personal. See, I know people do anything for money. So I can't say that, you know, I can't, that wouldn't be conceivable. But if it was personal and he did that, talk about holding a grudge, adding insult to injury. Man, we man, see, that's why you gotta watch who you mess with. You can't, man, you can't get get on the bad side of anybody. This dude, if this dude would kill you after you dead, imagine what he would do before you die. This guy has had to have done some wild things. Perhaps they need to do a story about his life. Cause I can guarantee you, if this Oh, showed up to somebody's grave site and shot in the grave, shot into the grave. You know he done done all kinds of crazy things that his people was like talking about right now. I bet you everybody that know him said, man, man, remember that time? Remember that time Elson did this? Remember that time? You remember this time? Remember that time? And you know he got some crazy name like Dookie Boy, you know? You know, he got a crazy, he got, he got a crazy nickname. Guarantee you. 
like uh, Chicken Man or something like that. He, he got a crazy nickname because this dude is crazy for real. Man, shot the man after he died while he was in the grave. No more talk. What the mate is talking about.